Cheers, everybody. Welcome back to another beer review. We have an interesting one that really stuck out to me when I visited Vacation Brewery's tap room in Hebden Bridge uh, yesterday. Um, today's Saturday, so this review will come up most probably Wednesday. Um, now, they've collabed with this slot before. We've got Vocation with Thick Sauce, which are based in Leeds. Now, I've just been on the Thick Sauce website, and they're really, really cool. They do loads of different sauces and stuff. Um, I'll just show you one, for example, on their website. They're doing a Bucky Sauce. You remember the Vault City Bucky I did about a month ago? But well, they're doing a the sauce to go with it. Um, it says a blackberry tonic wine uh, barbecue glaze uh, for eight quid. Eight quid a bottle. Um, there it is. Um, so it's a really, really cool company uh, based in Leeds. And we have got a pineapple hot honey sour. Apparently they've done another beer with vocation and they did it a few months ago. Never got my hands on it. This is clocking in at 6.5% ABV. And there's the beautiful looking can, which is too good to throw out and it's going to end up in there. There's the back side of it. I shall read you what it says. Oh, by the, by the way, the beer is called You OK, Hun? It says a lip smacking, tongue tingling, face scrunching, sour, brewed in collaboration with thick sauce, a pineapple infused party in a can with whole habanero chilies and sweet, sticky honey. It sounds my type of thing. A zesty concoction of tangy pineapple, fiery hot honey, and a refreshing sour kick that'll have your taste buds doing the hula. So yeah, it did stick out to me in the tap room. So let's just crack it open like you do. Let's get the whiff first, shall we? Well, unusual. <laughs> it is unusual. It smells quite sweet. It smells a little bit like that type of sweetness you get from it's gonna sound really really bizarre like a like a very strong stout but the more you smell it you pick up the honey more honey than anything for me at the moment so let's pour it out like you do see what it's all about I'm a wuss when it comes to the hot stuff, if anybody knows. I like cormas and butter chicken. <laughs> if I'm out and I go for a Ruby Murray, that is what I have. <laughs> Why am I telling you this? It's not doing my street cred any good, is it, on this YouTube malarkey? There you go. Stick it there. Beer in a glass, as you can see. Slight haze to it. Um, quite pale looking, to be honest. Uh, uh, like a... Dissipating head, medium flow of carbonation. Let's get a whiff. Very much honey. Not picking up anything else. So I'm going to go in. Um, as the great Terry K used to say, chin chin, chin chin. Pause it for a minute. I just it wasn't to go out, it's to do the curtain. Um you get the heat straight away. <laughs> oh you get that heat. That's hot. It's making me sweat. It is hot. <laughs> straight away you get the chilies. Bang. You pick up the pineapple slightly, but I think the chilies are overtaking everything else. But this is a novelty beer. It's not to be taken seriously. Um, 
the honey's there. I think the honey's more pronounced than the pineapple. But as soon as you go in, you greet it with heat. As soon as you swallow it, it's the heat. It just goes. I mean, what type of level do I give the heat? I would say... Not as hot as mustard, but it's it's there. I think if you drink a few of them, I think you had a, you would have a head like a radish. Imagine that, having a session on these. So it's classed as a is it classed as a sour? Pineapple hot honey sour. Yeah, I mean, where the sour tartiness comes in, it's not really there. It's overtaken with all. The heat, and I'm getting the heat. I really am. Um, do I like it? I do actually. It's great. It's a great novelty type beer. Um, they haven't kind of like swayed from what they're describing it as at all, and it's great. It really is. It's warm. Mouthfeel is out of a sour. The tartness is there, but the heat is just knocking it for six. It really is. The honey's there, more in the aroma than taste. The pineapple is there, it's doing its thing. But my word, this is a great thing about beer. It makes you smile. This beer, it just makes me smile because they have pulled it off. They have pulled it off. It might not be perfect, but my word, they really have. And it's just giving me a grin. I love it. I love doing beers like this. Great, great stuff. One more for the road. That is great. It is. Um... It wasn't that expensive. I think it was only about four quid, actually. Never seen this one before. I suppose that's what, you know, it's great when you go to the tap because you do see beers. I was a little bit disappointed when I went to vocation because they didn't have a lot in. Um, this one I did, but few. Um, yeah, it gets a thumbs up. I, I think they've done a great, great job on it. They have. Um, vocations, you okay, hun? I'm okay at the moment. But I'll tell you what, once I finish that, I'll tell you if I had about a four pack of these, my head would be like a bloody radish. It really would. Thank you very much for watching this one. Please subscribe, murder me in the comments, look after yourselves. Time for the feet to hit the street, and it's a bib bib for me. Cheers.